It's way too cold. I need to get out of this barbaric wasteland. I need to go somewhere hotter. Somewhere way hotter. And no, I'm not talking about hell. Although it's very similar. India. That's right, you heard right. I'm going to India. That's why I have my suitcase open and ready to go. And I haven't been in almost 10 years. Last time I went was when I was 2005, which is when I also took this picture. I hate that picture so much. So I went on Twitter and asked you guys what I need to do in order to pack for India. And I got a lot of great and amazing and helpful responses. So I thought, why not return the favor and create a video tutorial on how to pack for India. First things first, you'll need a suitcase. That is the most important article of clothing that you will need for this trip. Second thing and most important of all is gifts. Now since you have a hundred billion fucking cousins, it's important and required to bring presents for every single one of them. Plastic toys from the dollar store. Close off the clearance rack at Walmart. Bonus points for the circle of life. Hey, what does the circle of life mean? Well, the circle of life is very simple. Finding stuff or cheap toys that were made in India and bringing them right back to India. And now let's move forward to gifts for the family. Plastic candles and cheap knickknacks from the dollar store. Handy pans from Zellers. And pots and pans because, you know, they definitely don't have cooking utensils in India. An outlet adapter. See, India has different outlets that barely work. It just looks like a skull or a devil because... It is hell, so... Toilet paper. Can you believe in India they use water to clean their butts? I mean, what kinds of backwards, archaic country are they living in? For an example, let's say you got some Nutella smeared all over your skin. Like that. What are you going to do? Clean it off with toilet paper or wash it off with water? Wash it with toilet water. Paper. Toilet paper. It's gonna... Wipe that right off there. All clean. Anti-diarrhea pills, because you are definitely 100% absolutely gonna get the runs, and that's enough poop imagery for one video. So here's a random collection of beautiful footage that'll definitely distract you from the topic at hand. I'm just gonna go ahead and pour these, pour the syrup. You're welcome. Deodorant, soap, and toothpaste. You know, things that aren't really attainable in India. Cereal, because who knows what the f they eat for breakfast. Pepto-Bismol, avoiding death. Chopalan, because you don't know what you're stepping in and you definitely don't want to know either. <laughs> 10 to 12 backup dancers. You never know when you will find true love. <laughs> Mosquito repellent. Now, India has tens billions of mosquitoes. So what I'd suggest is bathing yourself every morning in mosquito repellent as opposed to water. That in combination with hot burning garbage and rabid dog excrement is going to make your clothes smell just wonderful. Extra money for the police. Now the Indian police is such a humble and extremely selfless organization. Their hard work and dedicated sacrifice should not go unawarded, so I suggest tipping them healthy amounts to keep them doing the great job that they already are. Perfect. That should be enough. Rotia, because again, who knows what the fuck they ate there. Bugs! Can't forget those. <laughs> like, could you imagine if I did? Where would I get some more? India? <laughs> Because, duh, I don't know. In case you meet Gurdasman and want him to reenact Challa. Yeah, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. And finally, some of your own clothes. Maybe like a shirt and pants because, and all honestly, that's all you probably have room for anyway. And there you have it. Once you're done all that, time to zip it up, wrap in plastic wrap, duct tape, rope it, duct tape it again, wrap it up some more plastic wrap, add all sorts of colorful shit all over it, just so you know that it's yours. And now we get to the weighing process. Well, we're overweight. Looks like we'll have to start all over again. <laughs>